What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. You've seen me review a couple sauces from Emeralds before that I found at Ollie's for $1.19. And uh, overall they had six different kinds, so this will be third, fourth one I've reviewed, I believe. Yeah, fourth one I reviewed. It is distributed by Gina Group LLC out of New York, New York. You find it at ginagroup.com. And this is Emeralds Original Barbecue Sauce. <clears throat> So, we'll see how this stacks up to his other sauces I tried. Um, 16 servings per container, it's a 16 ounce bottle, 18 ounce bottle, sorry. 16 servings per container, serving is 2 tablespoons, calories of 35 per serving. So the whole bottle has 350 and, what is it, 350? about 560 calories if I did my math right, so that's not bad at all. So, we'll get right into the ingredients here. They are tomato puree, which is water and tomato paste, high fructose corn syrup, distilled vinegar, salt, modified food starch, molasses, natural smoke flavor, spices, Worcestershire sauce, or sorry, Worcestershire seasoning, which is citric acid, spices, including mustard, maltodextrin, caramel color, E150, dried garlic, spice extractive, natural flavor, silicone dioxide added to prevent kinky. Then we have xanthan gum and natural food fiber. Citric acid, sodium benzoate, and potassium sorbate as preservatives, dried onion, dried garlic, mustard flour, dried orange peel, and natural flavors. So, there you go. Sounds like it should be okay. We'll find out. Overall, the other three sauces I did, I think I did three. They, they, they were they're all right. I'm trying to do a consistency check. Oh, you can see right at the top there. There it is. Yeah, it is a little on the thinner side, but that's all right. Doesn't matter as long as it tastes good, right? But uh, let's pop this top off. Show you what it looks like in the bottle, and now I'll show you what it looks like when I give it a smell test. Here we go. It smells almost like. Like I said, if anybody out there has ever had open pit barbecue sauce, like I said, I don't know if that's a national thing or just a Pittsburgh area thing. I think it's a national brand. That's what this smells like. It smells great, though. It smells real. It's got that nice smoke flavor. Smoke scent, sorry. Smoke flavor. I haven't even tried it yet. But uh, now we're going to get that smoke flavor because now we're going to put it on our spoon here. And remember, don't taint your sauce, people. Don't spend 30 bar, thirty dollars. Don't spend thirty dollars on a spoon for some jerk off. Buy this for a couple bucks off of Amazon. Don't make a dumbass rich. Anyway, there it is, and it? actually a little thicker than it looked in the bottle. Way thicker. Okay, I would give that a good six, six and a half on my viscosity scale. That's pretty thick. It smells great too. Like I say, it smells just like open pit. If you had it, you know. <coughs> Excuse me. So here we go from Emeralds, his original barbecue sauce. Cheers. Well, I gotta be honest with you. Smell better than it tasted. My bottle. I don't mean that a bad. No, I don't mean like I, I, I don't like. It. I like it. It's good. It's a little on the water, watery side, like just a hint watered down. It tastes like a less uh, less faith less flavorful open pit sauce is what I'm getting at. It's good for the price. You can't beat it. Mm. What I would do with this sauce? Was there any sugar in this? No, they use corn syrup. There you go. I throw a little brown sugar in this, it'd be better. 
they used corn syrup. It's a little cheaper way to do it, I guess. Molasses. Yeah, you got to use the real brown sugar. I don't remember reading brown sugar, and I don't see it on here. Corn syrup isn't just just isn't gonna do it. But it's okay um, for what it is for dollar nineteen. It'll suffice. Um, what I use this on? Like I said, I add a little bit of brown sugar to it. Put on ribs, chicken, you know your basic things, a burger, a hot dog. It's not bad. Just needs a little bit more flavor, but. For buck nineteen for an eighteen ounce bottle, I can doctor it up. It'll be fine. Anyway, um, so that's from that's uh, original barbecue sauce from Emeralds. So now heat, it's a zero. Flavor, <sighs> excuse me, torn between two. So I'm gonna go right in the middle. Five and a half out of ten. Would I buy this again? Mm. And then and now I'm starting to think about it. For a dollar nineteen, I can go to Walmart. Go to Walmart and I can get a bottle of open pit for a dollar ten. So I'd probably just buy that. So I don't think I would buy this again unless it was a last resort. But again, it's Emerald's original barbecue sauce. Zero on heat, five and a half on flavor. I'd buy it if I had to, but I wouldn't buy it if I had a choice. Just saying. It's okay. Just when I get open pit, same size, same eighteen ounce bottle for a dollar ten. I'd just buy that instead. Anyway, my opinion, but hope you enjoyed this review, and as always, see you next time.